Okay, what are you doing? Gonna plant some sugar cane down here, down this row that I dug out. It's really easy to plant and grow. So that's what I'm gonna do. All right, we'll watch ya. These little things right here, they're called eyes, kind of like potatoes and they're on opposite sides of each one. And this is where the new sugar cane's gonna grow. So you take about four and then you cut it in the middle. So that way each one has at Wait, least- Wait, that wasn't four. That was one, two, three. So you cut it between three and four or you cut it- One, two, three, four. Yeah. One, two, three, four. So I guess maybe you cut it right here. So you'd have one, two, one, two on each piece that will give you a better chance for it to propagate Sprout. and grow. So I'm gonna do that and I have two different kinds. One is a red sugar cane and one's a green one. I don't know the official names, but they all have the same eyes and where you cut and then you just lay it out, cover it up, water it, and it should start to grow. When does it grow? Um, at nighttime. <laughs> I have no idea when, it when does it come in? Come when in can where? you expect to harvest? Yeah. Oh, I have no idea. Next fall. Next fall. <laughs> oh, okay, next fall. So, there you go. All right, so I'm gonna take my cutters and I'm gonna have my trusty hand, Raina, hold this. Hold it like this way. And we're gonna count one, two, three, four. I'm gonna cut right there. On that side, I'm gonna cut it down the middle. There we go. Do you want oh, the small sorry. shears? Nope. Would those have worked? No, nah, this is good. And then you take it. So the, the, the eyes are facing either down or up. And that's it. Then take the other one count up. Do four more. Right here. I thought you were actually here. So do you put them on the ground? Four. So we do it right here. Okay. Uh, an eye there, an eye there, an eye there, an eye there. And you just want to butt it right up next to the other one. Right in there, just like that. So if these two start to sprout, because mm -hmm. it's all connected to the same stock, all the nutrients and all the energy is going to go to here, and then oh. these ones over here won't. Oh, so okay. when you split it up, it actually allows it for more to, 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 propagate, to propagate because it's Like it'll one. probably get two. That yes. will propagate out of those ones and then two that'll propagate out of the next one. As opposed one. to there's like six on this or eight, but you're only gonna get two, two if two pop up where I could at least guaranteed possibly to get four. Okay. So okay. So we're gonna cut right here. Actually we should probably cut right here because this one's already broke right there from yesterday when I was trying to get the frisbee. The frisbee. <laughs> in there and see probably can't see see how that black things in there mm -hmm. did you see that did you know what those are yeah something they're ants sugar ants yep so ants. ants coming out of there they got inside
And what happens when you have extra? What do you do? Plant it. No, you give it to your friends. So, I want we to have eat. one extra one. And we're going to give it to our friends. Is that a deep enough trench? Yeah. Doesn't have to be very deep? Okay, if I spill the seeds over there too. Okay. Then, once it's all... A worm! Mm -hmm. Some soil. And we just cover it up. Can I step on it? dog will also like them. Peter, come. Here. Here's a look, 360 view of what our backyard is looking like right now. We had a big chip drop just recent. We put it up underneath our satsuma trees back over by that wheelbarrow. And we've kind of slowly just moved it out to the edges of our yard put our trees in ground and mulched around them and all along the edges of the chicken run and our garden. Eventually this whole area is gonna get mulched, but guess what, we need another chip drop already. Just love this time of day. It's at sunset, everything is golden and beautiful. That's a look at our garden. Thanks for watching, guys. We'll see you next time.